Greetings everyone, myself Riya Kalsotra and my registration number is J19 Agri 1076. Our course instructor Dr. Prashant Bakshi sir has given us an assignment and my topic is Production Technology of Apple. So the content of my topic is Introduction, Classification of Apple, Description, Planting Time, Cultivar, Spacing, Pollination and Pollinizer, Flowering and Fruit Set, Propagation, Rootstock, Morphological Characters, Practices for Induction of Early Flowering, Fruit Drop, Plant Protection Measure, Water Management, Nutrient Management, Maturation and Harvest, Storage, Pest and Disease and Production and Nutrition. Let's start with an introduction. So apple trees are cultivated worldwide and are the most widely grown species in the genus Malus. The tree originated in Central Asia and apple have been grown for thousands of years in Asia and Europe and were brought to North America by European colonists. Then classification. So apple belongs to the kingdom Plantae, class Tracheophytes, order Roseales, family Roseaceae, genus Malus, and species are of the different kinds and one of them is Domestica which I mention here. Now planting. So pit size of apple tree is 1 meter into 1 meter into 1 meter and planting size uh, is adopted here is square or hexagonal planting system. And the average number of plants in an area of 1 hectare can range between 200 to 1250 and 4 different categories of plant densities are followed. Low, less than 250 plants per hectare, moderate, 250 to 500 plants per hectare, high, 500 to 1250 plants per hectare, ultra high, more than 1250 plants per hectare. So there are different uh, cultivars of apple and in Jammu and Kashmir there are golden delicious which is late season crop, lal ambri, mollis delicious, star crimson, red june, irish peach etc. And in Himachal Pradesh there are golden delicious which is late season, red delicious, mid season etc. And in Uttarakhand and Uttar Pradesh there are chobatia and anupam which are sown. Now soil. So apple grow best on a well drained loam soils. Loam soils having a depth of 45 cm and a pH range 5.5 to 6.5. The soil should be free from hard substrata and waterlogged condition and soils with heavy clay or compact subsoil are to be avoided. Then irrigation. The critical stage of apple for irrigation is fruit set and the water requirement of apple is 114 cm per annum which is 15 to 20 irrigations and in summer irrigation is provided at an interval of 7 to 10 days while in winter it is given at an interval of 3 to 4 weeks and note at, at, at least 8 irrigation are to be provided during critical period. August or a now fertilizer application. So during planting, 30 to 40 kg of FIM, 500 gram of single superphosphate and 50 gram of malathion dust are added after mixing properly in each pit. And NPK ratio is 70, 35 to 70 gram per year. And so there are different elements and uh, chemical dose and time of spray. Nitrogen in the form of urea 5% pre petal spray calcium CaCl2 0.5% 30 to 45 days before harvest zinc ZnSO4 0.5% all petal fall manganese MnSO4 0.4% all petal fall boron H3BO3 0.1 before bloom and after bloom flowering pollination and fruit set so apples start bearing at the age of four to six years spur type varieties start bearing early date than standard bearers and similarly signed cultivars start bearing earlier if grafted on a drafting rootstock than on seedling rootstock apple bears terminally or on spurt flower bud differentiation take place in july and flowering in spring so there are some morphological characters of flowering. So buds are ovoid with imbricate scales, leaves are serrate or lobed, folded in bud and stipulate. Flower buds are mixed buds born terminally on long shoot depending upon the cultivar age and vigor of tree. The initiation of flower primordia start about 3 to 6 weeks after full bloom in June. Inflorescences determinate having 5 flowers and flower white are pink or in signs. 
Flowers of most cultivars are epigynous and hermaphrodite and flower consists of 5 petal, 5 sepal, 15 to 20 stamens and which is divided into 5 carpels each containing 2 ovules and ovary is inferior in apple tree. So there are some practices for the induction of early flowering. First one is spreading of branches. So bending of branches of the junk trees at an angle of 45 degree from the main trunk helps in early flowering. Then pruning. If the trees are excessively vigorous, dormant pruning should be limited to cuts that are absolutely required because dormant pruning will induce excessive vegetative growth and inhibit flower bud formation. Then nutrient control. The tree should get sufficient nitrogen that should not inhibit the flower formation the nutrients like zinc, uh, copper, boron detrimental for flowering in apple. Linking and scoring. It is performed one or two weeks after full bloom using a sharp knife. This practice may however induce blossom bud formation during the year of treatment but can cause some trees to show severe shock symptoms. Then pollination and pollinizer. Most of the apple cultivars are self unfruitful and require some compatible cultivar for cross pollination and root food set. Sterility and incompatibility are the two main causes of unfruitness fullness in apple the cross pollination in apple can be improved by planting 25 to 33 percent pollinizers now weeding so application of glyphosate at the rate of 800 ml per hectare or gamma zone or paraquat 0.5 percent as post emergent herbicide suppresses weed growth for four to five months then fruit drop in apple there are three distinct fruit drops early drop in, in proper pollination or unfertilized blossom and june drop this is due to the moisture stress and fruit competition and pre-harvest drop which is caused by the most serious economical loss and it is managed by pre-harvest drop can be controlled by spraying naphthalene acidic acid at the rate 10 ppm about a week before the expected drop now propagations so it is propagated by grafting as well as budding and rootstock so first of all grafting apples are propagated by several methods with whip tongue cleft and roots grafting tongue and cleft grafting at 10 to 15 cm above the collar during february and march gives the best result usually grafting is done at the end of winter and budding apples are mostly propagated by shield budding which give a high percentage of success the optimum time of budding is september in kashmir valley high hills of hp and june in june in mid hills of hp so root stock most of the apple plants are grafted or budded on seedlings of wild crab apple the seedling root stock obtained from the seed or deployed cultivars like Golden Delicious, Yellow Newton, Granny Smith can also be used. So rootstock, there are uh, like clonal rootstock in western countries use of seedling rootstocks are abundant and now standard clonal rootstocks such as Maling and Maling Morton are developed at East Maling Research Station and John in Research Institute Martin are used. Clonal rootstocks are uniform and resistant to some insect pest and disease and promising clonal rootstock are M9 or EML9 and M26 or EMLA26 which are dwarf. Now seedling rootstock. Traditionally seedling rootstock are used in our country. Seedling rootstocks are vigorous, provide well developed root system, good anchorage but they are not uniform in size, shows heterozygosity, collection of seeds from various sources further complicates their likely characteristics. Seedling of crab apple, malice piccata are self pollinizing varieties like golden delicious and granny smith. An ideal rootstock should have, uh, it should make a successful union with a sign cultivar, it should be easily propagated, it should provide good anchorage to the tree, it should be easily available, it should have the ability to grow on a variety of soils and it should be resistant to biotic and abiotic stresses. Some plant protection measure. So, fully aphid, which is Aerosoma langigerum, most devastating disease in world, and symptom of damage, nymphs and adults suck the juice from the bark of the trunk or fruit and weakening and death of the smaller plant. So, it is managed by use resistant root stock M778, M779, MM114, MM12. Spray dimethoid 30 EC 0.06% or methyl dimethone. 25 EC 0.025 percent 
then fire blight the symptoms of fire blight are the initial symptom usually occurs on leaves which become water soaked then shrivel turn brownish to black in color and fall or remain hanging in tree and management removal and destruction of affected parts and spray with streptomycin 500 ppm then scab symptoms symptoms appear on leaves and fruits on lower side of the leaf lesion appear which turn dark brown to black and become velvety on junk foliage the spots have a radiating appearance with a feathery edge then management clean cultivation collection and destruction of fallen leaves and prune material in winter to prevent the sexual cycle spray dry demorph 0.1% before flowering scab epidemic in gnk 1972 to 73 and hp in 1978 to 79 There are some plant protection major which are physiological disorder like uh, water coat caused by boron deficiency and it is managed by borax supply then another one is bitter pit caused by calcium deficiency and it is managed by calcium carbonate apply then roseate leaf caused by zinc deficiency and managed by zinc sulfate apply then production world production of apple in 2080 was 86 million ton and china producing 46% of the total and china is the leading producer of the apple secondary producers were us and poland and india gnk himachal pradesh and uttarakhand are the leading producers of apple then harvesting normally the apples are ready for harvest from september to october except in the nilgiris where the season is from april to july and the fruit mature within 130 to 150 days after the full bloom stage depending upon the variety grown and the ripening of fruit is associated with the change in color texture quality and development of the characteristic flavor and the fruit at the time of harvest should be uniform firm and crisp and the optimum time of harvest depend upon the quality and intended period of storage so nutrition an raw apple is 86% water and 14% carbohydrate with negligible content of fat and protein otherwise there is a low content of uh, micronutrient and uh, apple uh, is very good for lowering the hypertension and it is also good for the diabetic person as well and it is a good source of fiber so here are some varieties of apple like fuzi gala golden delicious and uh, honey crisp and many more so in last there are some mcqs related apple crop like first one is king of temperate fruit is called pear apple peach or kiwi so the answer is apple the chromosome number of apple is 20 24 17 or 30 so the correct answer is 17 and third one is what is the fruit type of apple and the options are droop capsule pom and hespardium and the answer is pom fourth one is apple is propagated through grafting budding rootstock or all of the above so apple can be propagated through grafting budding as well as rootstock so the answer is the all of the above so next question is which country is the leading producer of apple so options are india china russia or none of the above so correct answer is china and then india is followed by china then sixth question is ultra dwarf fruit stock of apple options are m27 m9 double m 106 or none so correct answer is m27 next question is which state is known as apple ball options are himachal pradesh uttarakhand gnk or punjab so correct answer is himachal pradesh next question is apple is divided into how much grade 4 8 10 and the correct answer is 4 the grading of apple is 4 so thank you so much everyone and in last i want to say an apple a day keep doctor away